Welcome back to the pregame. Time now for our corridor drywall player profile. And tonight it is Brett Sheely, senior captain here for the Bears, wide receiver and defensive back. And Brett, uh, last Friday night you guys start off uh, one and zero, get the thirty-two to six win over West Liberty. Uh, how was it to just get back out there and uh, be able to play a game again? Felt good. It uh, definitely helped beating our number one rivals. Obviously, uh, I think we played pretty well on defense. Uh, offense was a little shaky, but we're working on that this week. Well, you mentioned that defense, uh, just real aggressive, uh, shut West Liberty down. I think it was probably late third quarter, early fourth quarter before they actually had positive yardage. What can you get attribute that to? Well, we're locking up on the outside, and then we're blitzing every play. So with linebackers crossing and everything happening, it's kind of hard to block. Well, and I know that uh, you've moved back out to corner this year. Uh, what's main difference that you see between playing corner versus last year when you were more inside at that safety spot? Well, this year's a lot different because we're locked up on the outside. So I'm more of a just strictly pass defense this year. So, yeah, it's a lot different. Offensively, you said, you know, you mentioned, you know, not quite where you want to be yet. A little inconsistent at times. Um, what do you really need to focus on as a team maybe over this next week or so to be able to get things clicking a little bit more? Uh, I think we just need to stick together. Um, in practice, a lot of the line have been working out a lot, and then obviously receivers and quarterback have been working on pass routes and stuff like that. And then I know we just got to kind of just be confident, really. Uh, how about your role on the team? I know that uh, you're a senior captain, uh, voted on at the end of last year. What kinds of things do you see yourself being responsible for, not only on the field, but maybe off the field during school or even just you know on a Saturday night hanging out with the teammates? Obviously, stay smart, and then kind of during practice and games, lead by example. And then the classroom, just make sure you're caught up and then help others if they need it with either like help with homework or anything, really. Do you see yourself being a vocal leader sometimes, or do you like to just do the lead by example? Me, I'm probably more of a lead by example, but she doesn't really like that. But, yeah. If you had to, though, I mean, you'd probably get on some guys if you needed to. Yeah, I can. Well, you've got Wapolo coming up here tonight, uh, first road trip of the season. What are you expecting to see out of the Indians? Um, they're not a too bad team. I mean, we can't overlook them, obviously. We got caught doing that last year and it almost really hurt us. So I think we just got to play the way we play and we'll be fine. Okay. Um, we like to focus on other things besides just football. What else do you do? What other sports, other clubs, any other activities that you take part in here? Uh, I do 4-H, FFA, I play basketball. I took a year off from baseball this year. I don't know, thinking about going back out, we'll see. Other than that, then I work on the farm at home, and yeah, I really enjoy that. 4-H, FFA, do you do a lot of showing, or uh, you let the uh, siblings do more of that? I show through 4-H at the fair, but not state fair. Okay. Um, any other sports that you do? You know, you said baseball, uh, basketball. Uh, which ones do you like the best? Football still your main one or anything else that you really like out there? Yeah, football is probably my favorite. Okay. Uh, it's hard to believe because we're week two of the regular season here, but before you know it, this year will be done. You'll be looking at graduation, walking out of here for the last time. What's the future hold? What do you think uh, you're going to be doing after you graduate and move on from West Branch? Uh, my plan is to go to Iowa State for agriculture and then come back to farm. Okay. Well, you got that all lined up and ready to go. Easy peasy from there. But obviously the focus right now is solely on Wapolo and then week three and then week four and so forth and so on. Brett, thanks very much for joining us. Best of luck this week. Thank you. That is Brett Sheely, tonight's Corridor Drywall Player Profile. We'll be back with more of your pregame right after this. This is the Bearcast at westbranchfootball.com.